What's going on guys? So uh, today we're talking about clipper lighters. I have to say I'm a little disappointed and a little bit confused. So uh, I like uh, clipper lighters. I made a whole video on why I like clippers more than Bic lighters. Uh, they're refillable, they're reusable. This one happens to be uh, a raw <laughs> branded one for the, the rolling papers or cones or whatever they're, they're making these days. Uh, I don't smoke, I haven't smoked for a long time. Uh, that stuff anyway. Uh, but what's kind of interesting is that the uh, the little wheel and flint come out not only so you can change the uh, the flint on here okay because it is refillable but eventually your flint uh, you know just gets used up until it's gone so you pop a new one in there but they actually pitch this as a packing tool so if you have like a cone you're filling or something you literally use this to pack it which is on the instructions also when you put these back in make sure that they are in the right way so they still spark anyway so I love these things you guys are probably pretty familiar with them so I was at an advanced auto and I was picking up a new tailpipe tip for my wife's Honda because uh, the old one just got rusty and crusty. So uh, now that summer's here, swap back to the, uh, the summer rims and stuff looking nice. Got a little chrome here and there uh, and I wanted to just get her a new, uh, new tip. So when I did that, I saw this at the register. Impulse purchase is $1.49. I thought, oh, a clipper, cool. It's a different, different style. It's not the round clipper I'm used to. Well, when I got home, I opened it up, and I put it back in this package here just so I can show you how I saw it on the shelf. But I thought this was interesting because I, you know, lit it up. I'm like, oh, it's cool. It's just different. It's not round. It's just more Bic style. And I looked at it, and I looked at the wheel. I'm like, oh, that's weird. It's just kind of round instead of this one. So I went to go pull this out, and I can't because it doesn't come out. Then I looked at the bottom and realized it's not even refillable. What? Now, that normally wouldn't be a problem. However, the packaging here clearly shows the round one and it's refillable. And it says reusable up to 3,000 lights each. Reusable. So we flip it over and it shows here, here's the packing tool. They're showing how to use that in case you're packing your product into a, a cone or something. All right. And you can read the rest of here if you want, the back. Now, what I want to show you here is on the back it says made in Spain. Right, copyright Flamagas or whatever on the bottom on the bottom, excuse me, of this lighter, it does say that, which is like the parent company that make clipper lighters, Flamagas, Flamagas, something like that, right? So, if you look at the original clipper lighter, all right, clipper logo on the front and on the side, it says made in Spain. So they're there, made in Spain. This one says Main India, which is fascinating. And then if you look at the uh, like UPC code that's here, this ends in a six, right? If you look on the back here, there's actually a UPC sticker over an original UPC. Looking through the original UPC says six, but this one doesn't. This ends in a one. Um, so I don't really know what's going on here. But I was just a little disappointed this is not refillable. Now, under a little bit more very brief, sloppy research, I think this one was called the Brio, the Clipper Brio, and I think they discontinued it. Because originally, uh, reading like a Reddit post or something, I don't even know how accurate the information is, but originally these were on their site for a little while, then they got rid of them. For some reason, I can't find these for sale anywhere other than Advanced Auto. Now, if you... Click or, you know, go onto this uh, little QR code or whatever it is. Hold on, let's see. Let's see what this is going to bring us. Whoops. All right. Go to Clipper's official website. Sure, I'll allow some cookies. Who doesn't like a good cookie? All right, so when you're looking at their different pocket lighters and stuff, they just don't have these anymore. They have a bunch of different sizes, but they're pretty much all round or they're electric. All right, classic fit. So these are electric lighters, okay? So they have more of a flat appearance, but there's no, you know, wheel or anything. Uh, I just thought it was it was fascinating, right? Now, if I go to uh, Advanced Auto's website here, and you type in uh, Clipper, you can see it's the exact lighter that I bought at their shop. So they might have bought, you know, a bunch of them from a warehouse or something and put them in all their stores. $1.49, all right? Clipper individual lighter. Now, here's the packaging. What's, what's different? Do you notice anything different between this picture and the packaging? They're pretty close. This one has a red bar that says improved child resistant feature. Okay. Uh, but what's missing is the actual packaging here 
shows the gas filling up this regular clipper lighter. So I feel like this packaging was for a regular clipper lighter, even though it doesn't really fit in there. <laughs> At least the backing was, maybe not the plastic, but the backing was originally for the round ones. Because you see it's oval, so the plastic was kind of meant for this one, because it fits in perfectly as it should. Yeah, I just thought that was interesting. On their website, it doesn't show that it's refillable. It still says up to 3,000 lights, but this one says reusable. Reusable. This is not reusable. You can't fill it. You can't change the flint, at least not easily. You're not supposed to. So this was false advertisement. I've been had for $1.49. So I want to make this video, because I thought this was really fascinating. Um, this is kind of stuff that uh, excites me. Maybe I'm getting old, maybe I'm just too much into gear and stuff, but I thought this was a, a fascinating uh, find. So although I like the lighter, it's fine. And just like a regular clipper, we turn it upside down, the gas comes out uh, a little bit stronger. All right, that's really for pipes. You get down into the bowl of a pipe. Same with this one. A little bit of a higher flame. It's cool and everything, it's comfortable, it works fine, but it's not reusable, even though the packaging says reusable, but their website does not show reusable. So I don't know if these are old packages, you know, not that it's a huge deal or anything, but just a little heads up. Uh, if you did want this lighter, you can find an advanced auto, but if you are an advanced auto and you see this lighter and you're a huge fan of clipper lighters and you're like, oh, cool design, like I thought, buyer beware. It's not reusable, it's not refillable, $1.49, and then it's garbage. But yeah, just wanted to document this insane find that's going to change your life, or... Not so much. That's all. Uh, for all the you know, people out there interested in lighters and stuff, I, I thought it was worth uh, pointing out. It was a weird experience. Uh, I'm not all that disappointed. I think my $1.49 was well spent, but I did think I was going to be able to refill it, and I'm not. So when this is dead, I'll just keep refilling this uh, this raw one. I have a couple of these. I got a gray one. I have one with like uh, I don't know some kind of tie dye pattern or something. And of course, because you can refill them, they just they last a really long time. So that's it for this one, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Let me know if you've found any uh, tomfoolery going on at places like Advanced Auto with their fake reusable lighters for sale. Shameful. Uh, yeah, obviously I'm just being sarcastic. I don't care all that much, although it should definitely have uh, accurate labels for the products that you're buying, right? I think we all agree with that. I think so. All right, that's it. I hope you guys have a good one, and I'll see you tomorrow with a brand new video. Take care.